Hello everyone, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Shannon and if you're new here, make sure you subscribe. Um, and I'm so excited for today's video. I'm going to be filming a huge fall haul. Well, not huge, but relatively big for me. I don't usually do a lot of shopping at one time. I usually buy like, you know, a couple things here and there over a season, but I just am so excited for fall. I'm definitely a basic girl when it comes to fall. I love my sweaters. I love my pumpkin spice. I love my fall nail colors. I just got these nails done the other day. They're like a dark navy, I'm obsessed. Um, but yeah, so I'm so excited. I feel like fall is the best time of year for putting outfits together and styling things. There are just so many options and yeah, uh, I got a lot of great stuff from all my favorite stores. Uh, Lulu's, Urban Outfitters, Princess Polly. Um, what else? I'm missing stuff. Oh, and Revolve. I got a couple things from there. Um, but yeah, so let's just uh, jump right into it. So the first thing that I got is from Princess Polly, and it's actually this sweater that I'm wearing right now, and it's just a basic, cream, comfy, cozy sweater. And I feel like you can never go wrong with one of these for fall because you can literally wear it with anything. I can see myself wearing it with, you know, just jeans and sneakers or jeans and boots or leggings or even a skirt. Like you can wear this with literally everything. And it's just so comfortable and so soft. I really like the neck because it is kind of like wide. Like you can have it be off the shoulder a little bit or you can just, you know, have it be regular which i think is really nice especially because a lot of the items i'm going to be showing i bought to transition from work to regular life so you know sometimes you need to be a little more appropriate and then sometimes you can spice it up a little bit so yeah i love this sweater also disclaimer if you can hear like music in the background or the television that is just my family sorry hopefully you can't hear them over me because that would suck um, the next thing that I got from Princess Polly is this tie-up blouse and it's got this really pretty floral design that I just think is so cute for fall. I love red in general, but I think red in the fall, especially like this deep dark red is really nice and yeah, so this top I definitely bought for not work. Um, it's pretty sheer and uh, basically, I don't know if you can tell in this, but I'll be doing a try on portion um but basically it ties up in the middle and yeah it's just super cute and it's got these little ties up here that you can either leave hanging or you can tie them together i think i think i'd probably leave them hanging though um but yeah i think this is super cute to wear with either like a uh, just a pair of black jeans or a skirt. I have this one skirt that I have in mind that I think would give it a nice little hippie vibe for fall, which I think is really cute. And again, I just think that the floral pattern on this is so pretty and I think it will look so nice for fall. The next thing that I got from Princess Polly is this really cute oatmeal skirt and it's got a nice little slit in it which I just think is so cute and I'm always weary about buying skirts online because I feel like I need a really odd size because you know I'm pretty short so anything long looks kind of weird um but also I have like a wider midsection so you know buying anything and having it be too small there always sucks but this actually fits like perfectly I think and it's kind of like high-waisted which I really like I love high-waisted things um and yeah so it's got a zipper in the back which again, I'm always weary of things like skirts with zippers that aren't just like stretchy. Um, but actually once you wear the, like have this on, it's super comfortable. It's not restricting or anything, which I love. And this is another piece that is, you know, just a plain basic color, pretty basic, but this nice little slit, it just kind of spices it up a little bit and I love it. I think it would be a really great piece. The next store I got some things at was Lulu's, which I love Lulu's. I just think they have some of the cutest things for the best quality for the best price, which is just, you know, checks all the boxes. The first thing that I got is actually a free people item that I already own, but I got it in a different color. Um, it is this free people Adela bralette. It's super cute and basic and again, something that you can wear with almost everything. That seems to be kind of a trend for me. Um, but yeah, it's just super pretty and lacy. I've always loved these bralettes and I bought myself a nude one from Revolve and I was obsessed with it for like three days until the strap decided to break, which was really annoying. 
And you know, it's a free people item, it's from Revolve, like it shouldn't do that. So anyway, I ended up returning it and getting um, another one, but they didn't have the nude color that I wanted. So they sent me a copper one. And I got it in the mail the other day and I go and open it up and I'm like, this looks tiny. It was like literally a small, like no way was that gonna fit me. And I was like, are you kidding me? But the thing was labeled a large, like, like the little tag right here said large and everything. Like it didn't make any sense. And I thought I was going crazy. And then I ended up doing like the live chat help thing. And you know, she didn't question me. She just sent me another one, which not this one, this one I bought from Lulu's, but the other one is on its way here and it's actually in nude, so that's good. Um, but so I got this one the same day that I got the other one and for size reference there was like this much difference actually I took a picture let me show you I don't know if you can see that but over here like there was a good two inches or so on each side of the size difference so I was like this is not a large even though it's marked a large in every possible way so I just want to make sure I wasn't losing my mind which I wasn't but that was frustrating, but luckily Princess Polly has pretty good customer service, so I actually should be getting the nude one tomorrow. Um, but anyway, back to this. I'm obsessed with these bralettes. I just think they're so cute and pretty and look really nice under things, and I actually think the nude one will look really nice under this sweater. And I'm always loving things like this because I really hate like regular bras. I really don't remember the last time that I wore a normal bra with like underwire and cups and all that stuff i just don't really need it i don't have a big chest and i just don't really need all that support so i love things like this that i can just throw under things so that i almost look like i'm like not wearing anything but i am um and yeah just another great piece that you can wear with pretty much anything the next item i got from lulu's is this black sweater dress and it's super cute super comfy you know it's a sweater and it's a perfect length it goes almost to my knees but not quite so like i can wear it to work but still make it work for not work <laughs> and have it be you know not matronly or anything um, and it's funny, I was actually debating between getting this sweater, which has like a relatively high neck, um, still a crew neck, not like a turtleneck or mock neck, or one that had a v-neck. And lo and behold, this one literally, I don't know if it's supposed to be reversible, but it is reversible. Like you can wear it either this way, so it's like a v-neck sweater, or you can wear it this way. I in the front and like lower in the back and it scoops like right under my back tattoo, which I think is really awesome. I love stuff that like shows that off. But yeah, just another super cute item and I'm always down for a dress for any type of season because that just means less work going into your outfit and it doesn't look like less work, but it is less work. You know, people that wear dresses, they know what's up for sure. So yeah, I just love this black sweater. I think it's so cute and basic and easy to be dressed up or dressed down. You, know, you can wear it casual or a little fancier if you pair it with like a high boot or just some really nice jewelry or the next item that I bought, I can picture myself wearing with this. So I'll move on to that. The next item I got from Lulu's, I'm so excited about. I saw this and I was just in love with it immediately. So it's this suede vest and it's pretty long. It's pretty like, almost this, it's like almost the length of a dress kind of. And it's just this really pretty like, mm, almost like blush color, but it's also got a little bit of purple to it. This part's lighter, this part's darker. And it's just so pretty and oh my god, I just, I love every single bit of it. And I feel like I can picture myself wearing this over so many different things, just kind of dressing them up and making them look a little different. Um, I don't know if I would wear them with this sweater, but I do have another white shirt that I think I could wear it with. Um, and again, I think I can see myself wearing it with that black sweater dress. And this is just a really nice item to have. It's really good quality, nice and thick. And you can tell the suede is like legit. Um, and I just think it kind of dresses up anything. Like you could wear this with a pair of jeans and a t-shirt and it would make it look like a little nicer. Like you put a little more effort in, which is always nice. It's got a little belt that wraps around it. So you can either tie it in the front to make it a little tighter or you can tie it just in the back and have them hanging there and just have it fit a little differently. 
I just, I love this piece. I think it is so nice. And again, like awesome quality, you know, Lulu's is again, known for having nice stuff, cute stuff at nice quality, at nice prices, just everything you could possibly want. And I'm so excited to wear this. The next item I got from Lulu's is, surprise, surprise, another sweater. <laughs> um, I don't usually like this color. It's kind of like a brown, like rusty orange color, but it's one that, you know, is a, definitely a lot more, uh, what's the word? Drawn, I'm definitely drawn to this color a lot more in the fall because you know, it just kind of reminds you of fall. But so I'm obsessed with this sweater. It is a little turtleneck, but one side has a cold shoulder and the other doesn't. And I feel like that seems a little weird, but if you see a picture of it on the model or you know, I'm gonna do a little try on portion, I just think it's so cool and different and awesome and I'm obsessed with it and it's really good quality. Again, this was definitely a little more on the expensive side. I think it was like, I want to say it was like around 80 or something, which I'd never pay that much for sweaters. I think this is worth it. It's a really nice quality sweater. It's nice and thick and doesn't feel like it will like rip or tear or anything. And oh my God, I'm just obsessed with this. I think this would look really nice with some black jeans and some black booties. Um, I have some boots in mine that I will be showing you that I just got. I'm so excited about. But yeah, just another big cozy, comfy sweater. And again, I don't usually do colors like this. I honestly don't usually do a ton of colors in general. I tend to buy things that are neutrals, which I try to push myself outside of my comfort zone. Um, but what I like about this is that while it is a color, it's still kind of neutral because it's brown, so it's awesome. Um, but yeah, again, just a super cute turtleneck, which I love turtlenecks for the fall. I actually got one or two other turtlenecks I will show you. Um, and again, I just think that this cold shoulder is awesome. And you know, the two cold shoulders, I feel like it's kind of getting old. It's been around for a couple years now, but one cold shoulder, genius. Love it. The next item that I got from Lulu's was this little pair of loafers, which I've been wanting a pair of loafers for work for a while now. I just think they're really nice and casual, but dressier, like they can go either way. And yeah, I love this color. They're just kind of like a light brownish, like almost nude, I would say. And I just feel like these are so nice and comfortable and I love slip-on stuff for work. I just feel like you can wear these shoes with almost anything. Again, that it's a trend in this haul for sure, wearing, finding things that you can pair with pretty much anything, which I love. And it's always nice to have a nice pair of loafers. And I never used to be a big fan of the pointy toe style, but I think maybe working in an office has made me like these more. I don't know why. I feel like they make things look just a little bit dressier, which I really like. So big fan of these. Can't wait to wear them. I feel like, again, you can wear these either in a more casual setting with some jeans and a t-shirt. You can also wear them with like dress pants and <laughs> I said dress pants, so weird. You can also wear them with like dress pants and a nice blouse or something like that. I just love. The next thing that I got from Lulu's is, surprise, another sweater and another turtleneck. <laughs> I like to switch it up, you know? Um, but yeah, so it's this gray turtleneck sweater and first of all, it's so soft, which I just love things that are soft. Who doesn't? Makes everything so much cozier. And what I like about this is that it's almost like one of those like fitted sweaters but it's not and i like things that are kind of in the middle like not super loose but not super tight you know it's just just right <laughs> and yeah i love this turtleneck and i love how the sleeves get gradually bigger it's a little bit of a bell sleeve but not too much it's not like it doesn't look like it would be annoying if you were eating or whatever and I really love this sweater. Again, it's a neutral. You can wear it with almost everything, <laughs> but <laughs> I think it would look really cute with that tan or cream or oatmeal, that oatmeal slit skirt from Princess Polly. I can definitely see myself pairing those two things together. And again, this is another item that can work for either work or, you know, regular life, which <laughs> I love how I'm like acting like work is not regular life. Like work is definitely a part of regular life, but you know what I mean? Like work and then like, not work you know what i mean but yeah another turtleneck sweater can't go wrong i hate doing buttons 
Anybody else? So the last item that I got from Lulu's is this white button down blouse and it's pretty basic. You know, I just wanted something that I could wear with any pair of pants or skirt that I have for work pretty much. Although I can definitely see myself wearing this more casually with some jeans too. And I can actually wear jeans to work so I can wear this with jeans in a casual type of way to my office, which is nice. Um, but yeah, it's just this plain blouse. It's kind of more of a cream than white. I, you know, I thought it was going to be a little more stark white, but I mean, you can even see compared to, the, oh, I guess it looks a little more white compared to this sweater, but it's definitely a little more cream than I was expecting. And I really wanted like a stark white one. So I don't know for sure if I'll be keeping this, but I feel like I might as well because it's still a really nice blouse and I could definitely wear it for work. And... I don't know. Regardless of how white it is, I definitely think it's a really nice blouse and definitely recommend. This next item that I got is from Grey Bandit. It's a little online boutique and I love their stuff. They have really cute basic things and I've been eyeing this for, I want to say about a year now. I've been obsessed with it, but I just never leaped and bought it until just now and i do not regret a thing i'm so excited it's this starred leather jacket how cute is that i love stars i think they're awesome just so i don't want to say unique but it just makes things a little bit different like i have a black leather jacket that i love but this just kind of spices things up a little bit i've also been saying that a lot today i gotta settle down now um <laughs> But yeah, I definitely think this is just, oh my god, amazing. And it's vegan leather. It's not actually made it out of animals. So, love that. And yeah, it's just this really cute leather jacket. It's got some nice silver, almost platinum type detailing. A nice little crossover zipper and some zippers right here i haven't taken the little paper off them yet and some more zippers on the arms which i love and this just fits so nice i think it's gonna look so cute over just honestly anything i can see myself wearing it over this sweater i can see myself wearing it over a crop top i can see myself wearing it over literally anything like i just i love this it's again something that's a little bit on the pricier side but definitely worth it i think a good leather jacket is always worth it um and again, this one is just a little more fun than a plain black leather jacket, which I love. I just think it's so cute. I'm obsessed. Oh, I can't wait to wear this. The next thing I got was a pair of jeans that I bought at Nordstrom from Topshop. It's a plain light wash pair of jeans. There's no holes in it or anything, so I can wear them to work, which is awesome. And these are the most comfortable well-fitting jeans i think i've ever bought in my life it's so funny because i feel like they're the most comfortable but when i hold them up to like other jeans that i own they're actually like smaller technically but they just fit so perfectly i can't even explain and it's actually a funny story to these um i looked literally all around the mall the other day for a pair of light wash jeans with no holes which if you've gone shopping for light wash jeans you would know that that is very difficult to find. Um, so I pretty much exhausted all of my options and I ended up at Nordstrom and I found these and I was obsessed and they were perfect. And you know, going into Nordstrom, I was expecting to spend more money, but when I looked at the tag, I saw 42 and I was like, that's not bad at all, especially for such a perfect pair of jeans. So I get to the register and they ring up the 75 and i'm like oh like is that a mistake like aren't they 42 am i missing something and the girl looks at the tag she goes like oh they're 42 euros which means they're 75 us dollars 75 dollars on one pair of jeans is definitely not something i typically do but these jeans i just can't even explain they fit so perfectly you'll see in the try on portion they're amazing and i really needed a light wash pair that i could wear to work so I bit the bullet and bought these and again they're just a plain light wash pair of jeans no holes or rips they do have a little bit of a frayed bottom um and I think that this is like little enough that nobody would really notice it at work but if need be I could always cuff them a little bit um so that you can't really see like no one's gonna see that or say anything to me about it so I think it's fine 
But yeah, I love these because again, they're another transitional piece. You know, you can wear them to your job or you can wear them out and about, or you can wear them in the spring and the summer, or you can wear them in the fall and the winter. A good pair of jeans is always great to have. And again, these just fit so perfectly. I can't even explain. They're so comfortable. They look so great. I'm obsessed. Topshop jeans are definitely where it's at. The only thing is the price. So maybe look on Poshmark. Big fan, definitely a big fan. So this next item I actually got from Kohl's and it would not be a fall haul without a football jersey. One of the best parts about fall is that football season rolls around and I'm a big Patriots fan. I'm not a huge avid football watcher, but I do watch Patriots games every once in a while. And I'm always, you know, a fan when they're in the Super Bowl, which tends to be a lot. Um, go Pats. If you're not a Pats fan, you probably hate me because that's just how it is. But it is what it is. Um, so yeah, I just got this cute Tom Brady jersey. And yeah, it's pretty basic. It's their red alternate jersey. I thought it would be a little different. And like I said earlier, I just love the color red on me. I think it looks really nice. And the fun part about this jersey is that it was a kid's size extra large, which means it was only $40 at Kohl's. I mean, come on, you cannot beat that. Sometimes the men's and women's jerseys are like $110, $120, and it's just insane. So if you can fit into a kid's large or extra large, I definitely recommend it because you can save yourself some big bucks. I just think this is really cute and nice to wear with jeans, leggings, whatever while you're watching a game or if you're going to a game which i would love to go to a game this season i think that'd be so awesome but the tickets can be mad expensive you know if you know you know the next thing i got was from urban outfitters and i have been dying to buy these for such a long time oh my god i'm obsessed i'm so excited to wear these i got myself a pair of doc martin boots and they're just oh my god i just love everything about these i Ow, just hit myself in the face. Anyways, I just love everything about these. Like, I have almost no words. I'm obsessed. Um, it, honestly, Doc Martens are super in style right now. I actually wore my roommate's pair of Doc Martens uh, when we lived together, and I was so obsessed with them. They're so comfortable, and they feel like they go with, like, almost anything. Again, that's my favorite thing when things go with almost anything. And they kind of just like add a little bit of elevation to any type of outfit, <laughs> literal elevation. These are, I don't know if they're technically platform or what, but they definitely give me like a couple inches, which is always nice if you're short like me to have a little bit of extra height, but without like a increase in instep or whatever, cause they're just flat. They're like flat platforms. I really don't even know if they're platforms. I don't think they are. Um, but I almost got myself a pair with the laces, but then I decided that, you know, I hate tying shoes. So I decided to get this pair of Chelsea Doc Martens. So you just slip your foot right in and there you go. Once you break them in, they're supposed to be super comfortable. They're really nice quality. Again, these are a little more expensive. I think they were like 180 or something, but I bought them from Urban Outfitters and I bought them with Afterpay. And if you are like me and you're trying to save money and you're trying to, you know, still buy cute things that you like, Afterpay is amazing because you just pay for things in installments of four and there's no credit check, there's no interest, there's no anything. So like these are 180, but 180 divided by four, what's that, like 60 something? Yeah, no, less than 60 because 180 divided by three. You know, you know what I'm saying, like 50 maybe. Anyway, no, not even 50, because that's 200. Like 45, I forget. Afterpay is amazing, because you can buy things and pay for them little by little. So what I like to do is, you know, buy something the day I get my paycheck, so that every two weeks after that, when I get my next paycheck, the next installment comes out of that and it's just i love it it's amazing it's like having a credit card but not having to have a credit card which is great the first thing that i got is this cardigan and i bought it from revolve but the brand is tula rosa and it's kind of like this oatmeal -y, tan beigey type sweater and i think it was listed as like cream online but it's not cream it's like totally tan or beige or something like that um, but it's so comfy and cozy and it's just this really 
long cardigan with pockets and I love it. I've been wearing it so much. I've been wearing it to work a lot because I get cold all the time and I always wanted to have like a little sweater to put on. Um, but I've also, you know, worn it out and about and I just love it. Next thing I got, I also got from Revolve, but they are a pair of Nike Air Force Ones. These are like the most basic girl sneaker there is right now. But I needed a white sneaker to wear casually and I just thought these were perfect. And just like the Doc Martens, they have a nice little platform kind of, which gave you a little height, which I love. And they're one of those things that looks good with anything. I could see myself wearing it with jeans and a cute sweater or I've worn it with a dress, which I think is really cute, or you can wear it with a skirt. Like you can, again, wear them with literally anything, which I love. The next thing that I got, I got from the Lucky Brand Outlet, and it is this tote bag. And I don't know if it's real leather, but it's kind of leathery material, and it's just this nice, big, oversized tote that I've been using for work as a work bag, and it's perfect for that. I can literally fit my whole lunch in there and my workout clothes and all my other little things that I have in my purse. Like I can just fit so many things, it's awesome. I only take one bag to work every day and that just makes everything so much easier. Um, but the best part about this bag is that it's reversible. Like, isn't that amazing? I'm obsessed. I, I just, I love it so much. I wanted to get a bag just like this from Madewell, but I couldn't decide between the brown and the black. And when I saw this at Lucky, I was like, oh my God, this is amazing because you can have it be brown when you're wearing things that go with brown, or you can have it be black when you're wearing things that go better with black. It's just absolutely amazing, perfect. And it's such nice quality. And I really like up here, it's got this magnet to keep your stuff nice and together so it doesn't just sit open. And yeah, another staple for fall. And again, I've been using it as a work bag, but I've also used it as kind of an overnight bag when I stayed overnight like once or twice at a friend's house. And again, it's just perfect for that. I'm obsessed. Last but not least, the next thing I got is another pair of white sneakers. Um, but these are for running because I got myself some nice, not Nike, some nice Adidas boosts and they're just plain white and they have this black at the bottom which I think is perfect because I can wear them with any of my workout clothes and they'll still look nice. I've been trying to get back into running lately and these are definitely the most comfortable running sneaker I've ever had in my life which again is saying a lot because I've had a lot of running sneakers in my life. Um, they're just perfect. Basically, I was buying Brian, my boyfriend, a pair for his birthday, and he's obsessed with them too, and I was like, wow, I should just get myself a pair, so I did. Um, and again, I paid for these with Afterpay, and I got these from this website called Goat, and I'd never heard of it before, but basically they just have like a ton of sneakers, like rare sneakers, not rare sneakers, just regular sneakers, um, and I, I don't know if they're like used or what but they're somehow they're not bought like straight from the retailer it's like somebody buys them and then they sell them to goat and then goat sells them but a lot of them are brand new like these were brand new and the ones that i got for brian were brand new not used but they also have used ones that are a little cheaper there's just so many options and again they have like rare sneakers on there like colors of adidas boosts or adidas nmds that i had never seen before and i was like where did those come from they're like limited edition things like Oh, they have all the Game of Thrones ones. I don't know if you can buy those on Adidas' website anymore. You might be able to. I don't know. But yeah, honestly, these are just so comfortable. I'm absolutely obsessed with them. And I just had to include them because I imagine that they'll be my favorite for a while now. I did get one more item. <laughs> I got myself a Hydro Flask. This is nothing new. People have been using these for years now. But I finally bought one for myself because I had a water bottle that had this really wide mouth but no straw or anything and so I would have to open it every single time I wanted to use it and it made this really annoying squeaky sound. I can't even do it with this because this doesn't do it but it would go like every time I wanted to open it which was so annoying. Also, it was really annoying if I was trying to use it on the treadmill or something and you know, the water would just like splash me and go all the way down my body and it was terrible. So I decided to invest in a Hydro Flask. I got myself a black one. I was debating getting a white one, but then I decided that my white water bottle that I already had got really dirty really fast and I didn't like that. So I got myself a black one and I really underestimated how great these are. First of all, the straw lid is just awesome because you can just flip it up and drink it and it's so easy and quick. 
um, but also it really does keep things so cold. I had this in the car the other day when I was at the mall and it was like directly in the sunlight for at least two hours, maybe three. And I got back and I opened it and it was just as cold as when I put it in there, which is just awesome. And I just, I love it so much. And I also really like this little handy dandy, what you call it, handle, handy dandy handle. This really nice little handle to carry it by. Um, I did used to have a water bottle that had one of these, but it was plastic and it broke. But this is like, well, I guess it's plastic, but it's like hard plastic, not bendy plastic. So, um, yeah, I thought I would include this in my fall haul because why not? So that is everything that I bought. I will do my best to link everything in the description box. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in my next one. Bye.